For 40 days, every morning and evening. Everybody say, every morning and evening. For 40 days. Can you imagine that one? 40 kaadlaw. Buntag o gabi e. Oh. The Philistine champion, Goliath, strutted in front of the Israelites' army. So, sigig pang hagit. 40 days po, mga kaibigan. Sigig pang bully si Goliath sa mga Israelites. But never ni isa sa ila na may barog o mitindog o misokol sa maong hagit. So kung imong tanawan mga igsoon, for 40 days, talagang pinini, pinili na nilang mamuhay sa takot. They choose to live in fear. Talagang takot na takot na talaga sila. For 40 days and 40 nights, can you imagine that one? Talagang pinili na nilang mamuhay sa takot. Zone, living by faith or living by fear is a choice. I will say it again. Living in fear or living in faith is a choice. And it's your choice to make. Walang gagawa niyan para sa'yo. Ikaw mismo. Everybody say it with me. Ikaw mismo. Sit one more time, ikaw mismo. Sit last time, ikaw mismo. Ikaw mismo. Hindi sakto, hindi litro, ikaw mismo. Ang gagawa niyan para sa sarili mo. You yourself will decide. Should I live in fear? Should, should I live in faith? Mamuhay ba ako sa takot or mamuhay ba ako sa paniniwala? Matatakot ba ako or magtitiwala ba ako? So it's our choice to make, brothers and sisters. So I hope ngayong gabi, you will make this very important decision in life. I've learned in one of our sharing during our devotional, sinabi po ni Paul, hindi po si Apostle Paul, Paul, one of our members in the church, sabi po niya, uh, fear will never stop bothering you until you decide and step out in faith. Exon, I hope before this message will end, you will take that decision. This night, tonight, I will become a new person. I will live in faith Rather than living in fear, I will step out in my comfort zone and I will decide to live in faith. Can I make an announcement? Can I? Or me, I? Okay, announcement. Exon, if you will stay in the spirit of fear, you will never be joyful. You will never be peaceful. You will never succeed in life. If you stay in the spirit of fear, you will never, never get your healing. Tama or tama? Tama or tama? Pareho kong lingyan ay mong katapad, Ignacia, step out in your comfort zone. No, sa pikas kilid na po ni mo, Ignacia, siya, step out from your comfort zone. Parehas kang Peter, mga Igzon. During the storm, he stepped out from his comfort zone. He stepped out from the boat. Okay. Para sa mga disipulo at itong panahon na Igzon, the comfort zone was to be inside the boat, in the midst of the storm. I will repeat. During that time, when the storm hit them in the middle of the sea, the comfort zone is to stay inside the boat. That is the most comfort zone para sa mga disciples. But Peter chose to step out from 
his comfort zone. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? Isn't it surprising? He stepped out from the comfort zone. And guess what? What happened to Peter? What happened to Peter? Pastor, nalunod si Peter. Yes, check! Nalunod si Peter. But at least, nagtry si Peter. At least, bisag mubo nga panahon, even just a split of a second, no? even just one moment in time, he was able to experience what it feels like to walk on the water. Palagpakan na si Peter. 